Lock-in amplifiers are versatile instruments used to recover weak signals buried under noise, measure small changes in magnitude and phase, and are a critical component in many feedback control systems. Moku Lab's lock-in amplifier delivers the flexibility and performance of a digital lock-in amplifier with an intuitive block diagram interface. Unlike conventional lock-ins, which can be complicated to understand and configure, our block diagram provides a high-level view of the signal processing chain, allowing greater insight into how the instrument is configured. Interact with the block diagram to quickly adjust its parameters. Configure the input coupling, impedance, and gain. Set the internal oscillator's frequency and phase to provide the appropriate demodulation signal to the mixer. Adjust the low-pass filter's time constant and order. Represent the demodulated data in either rectangular or polar coordinates and apply a desired gain and offset to the output. MokuLab provides a range of block diagram presets to modify the signal processing chain, supporting a variety of applications. For example, select the desired demodulation mode, which includes a phase-locked loop option to lock to an external reference, or choose internal mode to demodulate your input with an internally generated sinusoid. You can also configure the path of the auxiliary output. By generating a standalone local oscillator, you can demodulate with an arbitrary frequency, such as a higher harmonic, or select the filtered signal option to send both demodulated signals to the analog outputs. The lock-in is also capable of acting as both a sensor and controller in a feedback loop with a dedicated PID. To tune the response of the controller, simply tap the PID icon and drag the proportional, integral, and differential gain profiles. The frequency response of the MokuLab controller is updated in real time. MokuLab's lock-in amplifier also features built-in probe points, allowing you to drop in a fully featured oscilloscope to observe and record signals at different points. Tap one of the probe points on the block diagram to start monitoring. In this example, we're measuring the magnitude and phase of an input signal with respect to an external reference. Automatically adjust the vertical scale by double tapping the oscilloscope screen and configure the trigger settings within the corresponding menu. You can also add time and amplitude cursors to the trace and measure important signal characteristics via the measurements tab. The probe points also feature an integrated data logger allowing you to record data at up to one megasample per second. To log data, configure the acquisition rate, log duration, file type, and destination. To begin, press the record button. When finished, you can export the data to an SD card, email, or the cloud for post-processing and analysis. Thanks for watching. If you like the lock-in amplifier, be sure to check out the full suite of instruments designed specifically for MokuLab.